Alright guys, this is a little uh, trick that I do with all my Falcons. I want them to run a bit cooler, so I do a jump up between those two relays there. And what that allows, allows the engine to do is trigger the high speed fan when it gets to 74 degrees. I'll just show you something in the cabin. Alright, so roughly that's where my temperature gauge sits there. Um, so it'll be coming up, there we go, the uh, fans have just kicked in, that's high speed fan. So that'll, um, it never gets past the end with uh, this adjustment. So that first graduation there is, um, or sorry, the one best before the end is around 70 degrees. So what happens is the, um, with this little adjustment, is it turns on the fan at 74 and it'll cool it. So it'll start climbing, we've got about 78, then it'll turn, turn back off at 74. So it keeps your engine temperature around 74 to 80 degrees roughly this little modification now Ford don't want you to know that um, They don't report anything from 92 to 108 degrees. You will not see your gauge ever go past the zero um, Or past the um, about where a and the L is on normal that area there. It doesn't report um, Because what Ford wants you to do and most manufacturers do the same thing is once your engine does have a, a fault where the engine's overheating it'll be up around 110 degrees what they want you to do is actually notice that uh, gauge hurtling towards the H so they deliberately don't report anything from uh, 92 degrees to 108 that's quite a fair big chunk in that instrument cluster so once it gets to 108 that roughly is between the M and the A You'll see that, you'll catch it with the corner of your eye, you'll go, oh wow, the bloody temperature's going up pretty quick. But it, it already was going up quick, it just, they never reported it to the instrument cluster. And that captures your eye and then hopefully you pull over the side of the road and uh, turn it down, sh shut it down. So, anyway, we'll go back outside and I'll show you this little modification. The, here we go, the fans just kick back in again. That's the high speed fan. So, what you can see with this is basically my, my gauge never really gets past the letter N. It always stays there. All right, so we're back under the hood. High-speed fans are running. High-speed fan is off now. I've just I put the jumper back on. It's one there. Put that back in place. And you hear that difference? They're both roaring loud, pretty loud. That'll keep this baby cool. Especially up in northern Queensland, it gets pretty hot up there. Put the uh, vacuum gauge just under here while I was doing some testing with the uh, 60 power VCT adjustment. Look at pretty good idle there, even though the cams advanced quite a bit. We're uh, 21 degrees, inches of vacuum. Alright guys, so um, there you go. Keep your car cool, perform that little modification and you'll run it about 74 to 80 degrees.